Hey guys, it's your boy Fred Gang Films. As you saw by the title, this is another customer review, and I'm here to show you Toxic Spring Trap. So, uh, disclaimer before I start reviewing him, I did make him out of Dark Spring Trap, so rest in peace for Dark Spring Trap. Actually, no one cared about him, so whatever. So, let's just get straight into the review. So, here is, uh, compare him to regular Spring Trap. They look slightly similar, just different color changes. So, yeah, um,. His whole design is just based off of spring trap. The teeth, the ears, the whole body, everything. Uh, the parts where I left green, I colored them with with a brown marker. So yeah, that's, uh, that's a cool detail. You may notice the bubbles around him. They're not 3D, but I don't care. Uh, I, th I like his head, especially this part where it's like magma, but purple. And it's like, it covers the whole entire body. The seams on the side of his head are exactly two spring trap seams, so... Yeah, that's the, that's the cool detail I like. I cut little holes, <clears throat> so I le left the green parts. I had to continually stare at my Toxic Spring Trap just to perfect this plush. You may notice on this arm particularly, he has like red spots where the veins on him are red. I studied him, and I saw that most of the time they were red. They change constantly, like whenever he's in different poses, they change from red to purple. So I chose red for this arm because that's the only arm that colors. Uh, this red spot's not supposed to be there, but I added it just because I didn't see it. His toes are blue. They were supposed to be red, but now that, now that I color them blue, they're kind of like dark shade of purple instead of a light purple. But, uh, yeah, so that's basically Dark Spring Trap. Of course, there's no effect, but this is a plush. It isn't supposed to have effect. I especially like the eyes. It's small detail, but you can notice that Dark Spring Trap has purple. I mean, not Dark Spring Trap. Toxic Spring Trap has purple eyes. If you look at his eye rings or something but um yeah overall i like him uh because i think we can all agree that toxic spring trap is like the best suit or skin that we got so far so yeah i'm proud of this plush i might be for the first one to make him i'm not sure someone else might have made him but i think i'm the first person to make a dark all right a toxic spring trap plush so uh yeah one thing i noticed is that you see these like little rips on spring trap i did not add them on on toxic spring trap Especially the back area where you see this big rip. It's not on dark, dark, dark spring trap. But that's because if you look closely, you can see these little lines going everywhere, like a web. That They kind of cover whole, the whole entire spring trap body. So, yeah, it's not something to worry about. So, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this co cool custom review with Toxic Spring Trap Plush. I'll definitely make more radioactive foxies coming on the way. So, yeah, get tuned, stay tuned for that. I'll make a review of him once I'm done with him. So, yeah. Hope you enjoy the video. Hope you like my custom. Be sure to subscribe. Again, thank you for a thousand subscribers. So, yeah, bye.